editor options page which we can access when we launch VI properties and then go to editor options or the front panel page which we access from options dialog box they, they both contain similar options We can use the VI properties dialog box to set the style of controls and indicators in the current VI. We can use the options dialog box front panel category to set the style of controls and indicators in all new VIs. In this video, we will see how we can change the style of the control or indicator LabVIEW creates when we right click a terminal and select create control or create indicator from the shortcut menu in the currently working VI. So let's go and see how we can do that. So let's first create a new VI by pressing Ctrl N and then let's go to the file menu and then VI properties. When the VI properties dialog box launches, let's go to the category from the category drop down. Let's go to editor options. There we will find the section labeled control style for create control and indicator let's select a style that we would like uh, the controls to have or indicators to have when we right click let's select uh, next gen style and click ok now let's test it let's select a function lab view function let's place it then right click and create a control and right click and create an indicator let's choose some boolean and let's create control and an indicator to see how our changes are being reflected let's go to the front panel and as we can see that our changes are now being reflected but what happens if we choose a pre-existing VI which has different style of front panel controls present on its front panel. Let's select some VI, for example this VI that I, I created for an earlier video. Let's see its front panel. Its front panel has this style of control and indicators. Let's close it and create a control and an indicator and see how this these changes are reflected as you can see these are the this is the control and this is the indicator that lab has created and it is the same type that that front that bi's front panel already had so if we now place something let's select from classic palette for example and we go to the block diagram let's double check yes and then create an indicator from the right click menu the lab view will create an indicator of the same type So hope this uh, cleared your mind regarding how LabVIEW creates controls and indicators when we right click 
on the terminals and how to set the default style for the current VI and for the for all VIs that we would work in future. Thanks for watching.